And Maxime Cropo, first time facing his former club, Claudio Bravo, gets the first start of the season on that left-hand side. Diego Chara back in the starting 11 alongside Ayala. Hugo Lloris in goal. Hollingshead stays over on that left-hand side. Ilya Sanchez protects in that six. He's got Otto West on one side. Slightly overcast, but a glorious day. And you can feel it in the air, a festive atmosphere. The Timbers Army in good voice. LAFC is in town. Portland wearing the green and gold. They're looking to invite the press and then try to build through the lines. The computer uh -oh. likes LAFC's chances, but on that note, Jonathan Rodriguez bears down, crosses in, it found the foot of Anthony, but he wasn't online. We were down there, by the way, and they watered it, and it dried up immediately, yeah. so we we're expecting a slow track, although so far so good. Evander, Mota! Flag is down, and it is goals in back, two back, two back games for the Chileno. Pipe Mora gives the Tippers the lead they craved. It jumps right before him. This is a full swing by Mora. Look at this ball. Curling freezes Lloris. Just <laughs> helplessly watches the ball. He was right. Still a work in progress with so many new pieces. Tillman. Oliveira overlapping Rob Valencia. Oliveira calls his own number. In the opponent's penalty area. Cuesta into the teeth of the Timbers Good midfield. Ball. Bogic gets it behind. One on one with Miller. Cross the goal mouth. Finishes at far post. Polish power. 22nd minute. We were wondering if this would be this kind of game. So far it is. Two goals, 22 minutes. We are level. They could be asked to play this position until the summer transfer window opens up. What a ball from Timothy Tillman. The turn, the power, the placement, the accuracy. It's a long dart, far post side net. Crapo goes full stretch to his left. Nothing he can do about it. What a fantastic response from Matty Bogush, LAFC, to level here at Providence Park in the 22nd minute. Second goal of the season, he scored in the season opener. Oliveira, Buanga's loose on this left side. If Oliveira can locate him, he goes that direction. He finds him over the head of Mosquera. Buanga, edge of the 18. A twist -off! He almost caught Maxime Crepeau. Bogus keeps his feet. Tillman, space on the right. Murillo. Valencia. Here comes Buanga! Enter stage right. Mosqueda. Anthony. Well, they have seen not the cleavage coming out of their back. Mosqueda. Evander! Yes! Golasso! Golasso! Evander! Right on cue! Doesn't show a lot of emotions but try and wipe off that smile off his face. Was it Tillman that let him go? Pops up, Mosqueda, little dink ball, chest feels the pressure, comes across. A twist to see something. Buanga, Bravo may have held him on, the flag is still down, Buanga's down. Oh, Penalty, nice. or just outside. Flag stayed down, Bravo kept him on. Well, the collision itself looked as if it was at a bare minimum on the line. Rubio Vasquez giving himself a little bit of wiggle room. He's pointing. Oh, and he's showing oh, straight red red for Maxime Crapeau. And again, a big decision for Joe Dickerson, who's going to have the opportunity to look. Is he, now, is he an onside wow. position? Domino effect here. If he's offside, none of this matters afterwards. But right here, the touch, the ball, his feet, the collision, all of those. Where exactly is that touch? It is outside. It is outside. His momentum but... takes him in, but again, none of this will matter if he is judged to be in an offside position when that ball is initially played through, Danny Bowanga. One of the things we're trying to avoid, and it's in close quarters, edge of the 18, Bogus and Atuesta would appear to be Bogus's chance. Gets it up and down! Matty Bogus has a double! And that situation with Max Cre Maxime Crepeau goes from bad to worse. 
Red card, 10 men, and the goal for LAFC. From Matty Bogush. Wow. Benjamin doesn't even move. Doesn't even move. I'm not sure he even saw it. That little hiccup, that little beat. As it comes up and over the wall, he never sightlines it, never reacts. And what a huge, huge goal this is. Matty Bogush is second for Steve Chirondolo to take advantage of the situation up a man here on the road. What a ball. Onside, Buwanga. And he hits it to the side netting. The, the halftime sub would not count as the window, so they do have a couple more windows too. Meanwhile, Evander, who has been magnificent, even in the second half, gets it up and it's off the post. Follow-up effort by Bravo. Bangs into Tillman. Evander almost bringing down the curtain. But this is what Evander is capable of doing. What a free kick that is. Gets it around the two-man wall. Pings the crossbar, comes back out. Claudio Bravo hits a sidewinder right to the kind of left arm chest area. Portland's chances, especially with Evander playing the way he is. Just hit the crossbar, has the corner kick. Evander, out there, and Lonnie's able to cover. An absolute rope. Antuesta. Playing a different position with Bogush and Tillman in front of him in that midfield. Oliveira, he hasn't been able to warm up the Jets yet. And now drives in the cross. Pantamis gave it a look. He knew it was close enough. Another memorable chapter in this matchup. Buanga, flag stays down. Pantamis, Kamara, it was there. 145 on his toes. How about this one? 90 minutes. Put it in the time capsule for this fantastic rivalry out here, out west.